Hey guys, what's up? It's Owie, and today we finally got to see the Need for Speed teaser trailer. Now, it's only 30 seconds long, and it only has uh, in-game engine footage. It's not actually gameplay footage. So, yeah, it's going to look like this, but it's not going to exactly look like this when you're playing it, if, if you see what I'm saying. Um, so, anyway, uh, the official trailer's release date will be on June 15, 2015, which I'm assuming they'll show gameplay on that, way, on that one. Um... I think that's around E3? I'm not too sure. I'm, I might be wrong. So let's head over to the website because the website has actually changed now. It says Need for Speed, a new era coming fall 2015. So yeah, it is coming out this year. And it's probably coming out in October or November, I would assume. Then it has a button for you to watch the teaser trailer. And then below that it says the full reveal on June 15, 2015 with the first look at customization. Now let's go back over to, or let's no, let's go over to the teaser trailer and look at the description. It says, Need for Speed returns in fall 2015 to the PS4, Xbox One, and PC. No word on the 360 or the PS3 anywhere in that description. So what I'm hoping is that they're just developing it for the new consoles and of course the PC. That's what I'm hoping and I'm guessing that's what they are. Or else they would have said 360 and PS3 there. So that's good. And it goes on to say, in an action driving experience that unites the culture of speed, the new Need for Speed game will feature deep customization authentic urban car culture, and a nocturnal open world, and an immersive narrative that pulls you through the game. So we are finally getting a story back in Need for Speed. I think the last time we had a story in the Need for Speed game was Carbon, although I might be wrong about that too, I might not be remembering correctly. But we're finally getting a story back, thank you, God. And also, it's going to be a nocturnal open world, which I guess it's going to focus on nighttime uh, street racing and stuff like that. So that, that's pretty cool. And also, it's going to have deep customization which rivals did lack customization so that's that's good we're, we're already getting a step up now let's go back to the website you scroll down just a little bit um it's another little section that says unite the culture of speed now i'm going to repeat some of the stuff i just said but um, i'm going to go ahead and say it anyway so y'all can follow with me go to the website so you can read it along with me if you have to i'll probably just put a screenshot right here the links will be down in the description anyway with over 20 years of experience in its review mirror need for speed returns with a reboot so i don't know what they're rebooting here um, I'm assuming since it's a nocturnal open world, it's going to be an underground reboot. Anyway, and, and like I said, they haven't um, released the full name for this game yet, I don't think. They might just call it Need for Speed. I have no idea. Anyway, a reboot that delivers on what Need for Speed stands for. Rich customization, authentic urban car culture, a nocturnal open world, and an immersive narrative that drives, you, that drives your Need for Speed game. Now, uh, next part, fueled by our very own car culture community, Speed Hunters has helped deliver a need for speed experience that is grounded in authentic car culture by driving into the world of past, present, and emergent trends of the urban car scene. Need for Speed will unleash a passion for cars and speed when it releases this fall, 2015. So, uh, with that being said, and with that beautiful picture of that Mustang right in the background, it's beautiful. Let's go down a little bit, and there's wallpapers. Wallpapers, yeah. And I can finally tell what that car is. It's a Porsche, from what I can see. It's a green Porsche. I don't like the color, but I like the Mustang. So yeah, those are wallpapers you can set as your desktop background. Pretty cool. So that's all the information I got on the Need for Speed game uh, as of right now. Um, if it is an underground game, I'm going to be very happy. I don't care, you know, what it's called. As long as it has street racing and cops in it, which of course it does! It showed it in the teaser trailer. It's gonna have street racing. I'm happy, I'm excited, it's going back to the way I know Need for Speed as. And I'm sure a lot of y'all are happy too. So, we'll see how the game looks probably this year at E3, and we'll see the full trailer then. Anyway guys, thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe. Remember the links will be in the description below. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button too, so I can update y'all with more information on this game or other games that are coming out that I'm interested in. Anyway guys, I'll see you later, y'all have a nice day.